today I'm going to be doing a video on slime kits and regular slime and showing you kind of what the difference is between the two of them when it comes to what they look like. So, let's see here. Today I'm just going to be doing regular glue and then just adding black glitter into it. I can't find my food coloring, so there'll be no like special color. Um, but let's start off with this slime kit. So this is the Galaxy Slimy Gloop and you can get it at Walmart. Um, so let's just get right into it. Help me mix it. And then what we're gonna do is we're going to add this and this and the glitter. Okay. Okay? Kay. Do you want to add a couple of drops to that? Uh, yeah, we're gonna add a couple of drops to the, oh, don't, 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 don't put that in your mouth. We're gonna add a couple of drops into here. Do you want to do that? Okay, now mix it. So now we're adding the food coloring or the the coloring, and we're going to give it that galaxy fill. Okay, mix it, buddy. Ready? And then after we've got that mixed in, this is what it'll start to look like. As far as the slime texture and the coloring all together. That's wrong. Again, like I said, it's not slime texture like you want. What happened? Yeah, you want to go play with Annalie? It is not the slime texture that you want. Um, I doubled the... Oh, baby, here. Do you want Mama to hold Annalie too? So it's definitely not the slime texture that you want um, when it comes to slime and making slime. Um, should we add the sparkles in, buddy? Come here, Annalie. Okay, um, now we're going to add the glitter and see how it turns out after it is 100% complete. I did double the slime. It still didn't turn out the way it should have because I, I only doubled it. Like, I followed the directions, so I just doubled it. Um, so now we're going to... Now we're going to add... The glitters to it and we'll see how that turned out. Ooh. Should we mix that in there? Whoa. Whoa. Now I will admit that with the coloring and all that that it gave us, it does look really cool. It's just not satisfying to really play with. Um, let's try and, you know, stir it with our hands. So, this is the way, and I am a total mess, but this is the way that the slime turned out. Um, mixing it with your hands makes it a little bit better, but it just still does not make it the texture that it needs to be. and let's start new a new project okay so we're going to move on to if we were to just make normal slime and I know my hands are really sparkly and all that but we're going to move on now my son did put some of the color in here so 
It will give color to our slime as well. We are just going to see how this turns out and compare it to the other slime. <laughs> hey, ready? You can play with that. You pulled the chair right off of the mother me. You can play with that while mommy works on the other slime, okay? Whoops. Uh oh. The way I like to do my slime is not with the with the sulfate. I like to use um, Tide as activator. So we're gonna start with the glue, and then we're gonna add some Tide. Okay. Oh, we didn't put that in there. We don't put that in. Well, maybe I won't. <laughs> we don't put that in there, buddy, okay? Now I'm covered in glue. You are a mess. Okay. So now what we're going to do is add the tide. You want what? Mama, Mama, a lot? Yeah, you can help me add the coloring. So we're gonna add some Tide and then we're gonna start stirring and see if we need more Tide. Mama, I know, you can help in a minute. You're gonna help me add the coloring. You're a mess, huh? So this texture of the slime seems to be getting there. We're gonna start mixing with our hands for this one. Uh, for this slime, I prefer to mix with my hands due to the fact that it, I feel like it mixes better. Was it stuck? So this one, I'm starting to feel like I might need a little bit more glue to match up with the Tide. I put a little bit too much Tide in it. So we're just gonna go ahead and add some more glue. Oh, my hands are so slimy. And then we're gonna just start mixing away. Well, maybe. <laughs> Mama, no, hang on, hang on, hang on, Koda. Gotta wait a minute, okay? We got, it's gotta get done first. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna add that to here, but we gotta, we gotta finish the. Hang on, don't open it yet. Don't open it yet. You go, you'll get it everywhere. We're gonna add it to here, but not yet. <laughs> We gotta, no, 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 no. So Hey, what did you do that for? I got your second. We were gonna put it in here, you goon. After we add a little bit more coloring. Hey! No! You guys gotta see this. So, uh, we had a bit of a mishap. And the little boy and Koda spilled the glitter all over the table. So I don't know if we're gonna be using 
glitter. Unless we can get it in like right this second. Um, so we're trying to give this one kind of a galaxy feel as well. Just to compare the two in Mama, color. But I don't know how well we're going to compare it now that it's covered in black glitter as well. <laughs> you are covered. So we're gonna add some coloring. Where's the purple? We're gonna add some more purple and we're going to see how well we can give it the galaxy effect. Oh, bless you. Okay. Whoops. So definitely when it comes to definitely when it comes to homemade slime compared to the packaged slime, I'd have to say the packaged slime does hold the glitter better than than um, homemade slime because if you look. At the homemade slime the glitter is all in the center but with homemade slime it is more stretchy and just more satisfying than the exactly my daughter just tore it to pieces like she could shred it um, it's more stretchy than if you were to buy the slime kits um, In my opinion, homemade slime is way more satisfying, all the stretchiness. It doesn't hold the glitter as, as good as kits do, but it's still, in my opinion, better slime. Um, so that's all I have for you today. If you liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Press that subscribe button and turn on your post notification bells, and I'll see you later. Peace.